In this video, I'm going to try and tell you all the things I've liked and things I've not liked about the Adidas Supernova Rise in under three minutes. What is up, everybody, and welcome to 4D Runs. Now, I'm going to try in under three minutes and bring you up to speed on everything I've liked and everything I've not liked about the Adidas Supernova Rise since I've had it. Okay, so I wanted to come back and let you know how we've been getting on with this sort of up-tempo daily trainer from Adidas, which features the new Dream Strike Plus midsole compound. Now this Peba mix of compound is something very different from Adidas, and I've actually really enjoyed it. So, things I've liked. I've liked the Dream Strike Plus uh, midsole. It's been a nice, um, addition to the lineup at Adidas. I've liked the outsole, which is not a traditional continental rubber outsole from Adidas. I think it's their own brand, but it just works brilliantly in the wet conditions over here during the winter months. I've liked the fit and the feel of the shoe. I really like the upper. I think I, I think it looks banging, by the way. I just love the look of this shoe. It's one of my favorites to pull out because I just love the look of it. But I like the way it looks. I like the way it feels in terms of uh, the overall comfort. And I like the feeling of sort of uh, inherent speed you get from it without really trying. It really tries to work with you, um, especially with the Dream Strike Plus. It really tries to work with you um, versus some of the other sort of softer, more cushioned daily trainers that are out there at the moment. Things I'm not liked, I don't like this extra bit on the heel. It does feel a bit clunky, a bit clumpy in the heel. Uh, the weight, I can't remember the exact weight, but it does, I wouldn't say it doesn't feel light versus some of the more up-tempo daily trainers that I've got. I'm thinking uh, Rebel from New Balance and the Razor from Skechers. But that's it, they're the only dislikes. Oh, I like the price as well. You can pick these up at Start Fitness. Use my code 40 runs, you're gonna get 10% off of them. So there's not really much to dislike with this shoe. It really is a good shoe, and it's one of those ones, if you're not looking for something that's overly soft, you know, like, and I really like the 1080 version 13, but you know, those sort of daily trainers are out there at the moment that are quite soft, and they're, they're just a little bit mushy. This is quite good because it is soft, but it's also propulsive as well. So look, there we go. I really like the Supernova Rise. It's been a great addition to my rotation. I think it's a cracking shoe for Park Run, if you do Park Run. But yes, I would definitely check it out and say, make sure you go to Start Fitness, have a look on there. But that's the Supernova Rise sort of report back. I really like the shoe and I'd recommend it to you. 